All right, we're at the stage of the job now where we're ready to start putting up our equipment. Take a look at this. We got our eight radios laid out here. They're all prepared with a uh, down tilt control cable for the reps. Our little bag of hardware is on here. It's all assembled with our mount, ready for our grounding and our jumpers on here. So this part's already here and over here. We got our pipes and our mounts ready to go. They're tied up, ready to fly that. And over further, come on over here a little further. In shop, we already got our antennas pre-tested. All the labeling is written on it. Take a look at this up closer. All our writing is on here to tell us what everything is supposed to be as far as the azimuth, the down tilt, the electrical down tilt, which those ret con cables control. Here we got our 800 band WCDMA, 1900 band WCDMA, and our future LTE equipment, which is the long-term evolution of this customer. So this being an odd one, it's a four sector site. We've got our eight antennas here. Got our pipes ready to go up and take a look up here. Riley's got himself up top already. Mason, who's my cameraman here, he's gonna be heading up right away. And we're gonna be sending up our equipment, our steel, our radios, and then maybe later today, land our antennas. We'll see how this goes here. Go! I'll send up Thor's hammer so you can re-rig it after. Good there. There we go. Radio's up, guys are landing up. One day, prep the radios with all the cables, prep some of the steel, fly all the pipes up, fly all the radios up. There we go, looking good. All right, let's go see what progress we've made here. Okay, what's that? Yeah. 
Get to these two antennas. Which was three steps going over. And how's Riley doing? Yeah, I can almost reach your sweater from there. Is it tied in? Well, maybe because it got a little breezy before. What a view, eh? Well, we don't have a beacon up on this one, but we got a flag, so everyone's going to see it definitely now. Plus, we got to stay just below the heights of that. That's the navigation radar, and we don't want to be in front of that one, even at this distance. Yeah, it's suddenly dropped in temperature fast. I think we pretty much got this done, except for those rats. And we'll save that for tomorrow. Because then we can actually hook it up once they swap these other antennas out. So every one of these antennas is getting changed, because it only has two jumpers. Once we change it, we're going to be putting in two more, so it'll have four. And an option for two more to make six cables to each and every antenna. And it's about the end of the day, time to go down. Heading down right away. Finish that one and wrap her up. Temporary quick fix. You're gonna go batty if you don't get your smokes? It's good here. Well, you haven't turned into too much of a, an a hole. So am I. I thought you'd be a jerk. <laughs> okay, I'm heading down. Almost stepping on you. You got your rope grab, don't you? <laughs> stepping on your head. I gotta keep my feet away so you can't get them. Oh, brilliant! <laughs> Rope grab on, ready to go. Yeah, the reinforcing's really in the way.
had your nose bag on there? There we go. All the equipment down. Only one man left. And that's good for a day's work. Brent, put it in a neat bundle and put it in tight and then tie wrap to the middle jumper. Yeah, that's cool though, that's good. Oh, we're missing a cap on one of those ports though for later. Oh yeah. The empty port. Okay, cool. I fucking took it off for whip. And some of these days, as the time goes on, we got to keep working and working and working to get it done. The customer's got a deadline on this job. They want this site up and operating by Canada Day long weekend, which means we have two days to complete this. And we just installed our jumpers today. Still doing our tagging. We got grounding to do yet. Uh, the technician just showed up this late this afternoon. Uh, don't even know what time it is. It's probably pushing nine o'clock. Still up the tower. We got another hour and a half up here till or less, depending. It's almost dark already. And I got to be back up here at the crack of dawn when the sun comes up. Continue on. We still have fiber testing, power testing, uh, and some issues to resolve in the meantime there. So, yeah, some of these jobs is just big push. Got to get her done at all costs. Keep on trucking. <clears throat> I guess you know it's time to get off the tower when, when it's so dark you can hardly see. Don't know if you can see, there's a guy coming down the tower right now, right by the microwave dish. That's how dark it is. This is called the push to get things done. Anderson's working away in there. Canada Day long weekend, flying the flag. 